I want to show you how you can easily create data entry templates from Business Central into Excel and then use those templates to easily get data back into Business Central. So first I'm going to show you how to create a template. It's extremely easy. Then how to use that template. And we'll look at transactions in the general journal entry and also the purchase order. So let's get started. This is my general journal form that I use in my system. So to make a template, all I do is highlight the first line, copy it, hit Control C to copy, and then go to Excel and get a brand new spreadsheet and then paste it, Control V, into Excel. And that's my template. I can use this going forward, just populate this template with data, and I can paste it into Business Central. So let's see how that works. This is my template. And what I've done is I've populated it with some payroll information. This is going to be a payroll accrual. So to get this into Business Central, all I need to do is copy it here. I'll highlight the items that I want. Hit Control C to copy. Then go over to Business Central and paste it in here. And it's that easy. I just pasted this into Business Central using Control V. And now I've got my transactions all ready to go. I can still edit it from here if I want to. I can delete it and start over again. Let's take a look at the same concept with purchase orders. So what I'm going to do here is fill in the header information for the vendor I want to use. And then I'm going to copy and paste the detail information into the screen. But first I'm going to make a template. I'll highlight the first line, copy it, go back to Excel, get a new spreadsheet, and then Control V to paste the format into Excel. Now for purchase orders, the detail line template is going to be pretty extensive. There's a lot of fields here but I only need to populate a few of these fields to make a purchase order. This is my template populated with information that I want to use to create a new purchase order in Business Central. All I need to do is copy this information here. I'm going to copy the first three lines and up to the unit of measure code. So I'm going to Control C to copy that then go over to Business Central and paste it into this detail line. And it's that simple. I took the information from my Excel spreadsheet that I created using a template format from Business Central, populated with data, and then copy and paste it from Excel into Business Central. You can use the same template over and over again. So this is going to be really good for recurring transactions. In this case, purchase orders from vendors from whom you buy the same stuff over and over again. This will make it a lot easier to do transaction entry in Business Central. I showed you how to create templates and use those templates in Business Central this is going to make transaction entry a lot easier. Mm -hmm.